hey girlies welcome to another weekly vlog my name is brianna if you're new here so today's saturday i'm not gonna lie i really need to upload this video by tomorrow but i have not edited it edited it Ooh, that's a tongue twister i really need to edit that vlog and i honestly was not going to pick up the camera today i was going to start my vlog on monday because i'm getting my hair done monday but it's like Day weekend and turns out i'm actually going out my boyfriend is dragging me out of the house so i'm going out don't know where we're going but we're going out in charlotte and i've i've never really been out in charlotte like clubbing and stuff so i feel like that'll be very interesting to see and i would have been stupid i would have been literally delusional to not take you out with me regardless of what i get and how i get it y'all's gonna see something so here i am um it's currently 4 37 i need to text and be like what time do i need to get ready oh he said i don't gotta be ready until 9 9 30 okay bet so i got a couple hours so i could just chill so i might try to go ahead and edit this one vlog or at least get it started so i could upload it at least by tomorrow night because i'm really on a winning streak here i've been really good about uploading my videos every couple of days i try to do once every week but if it comes sooner than that perfect if it doesn't i try to stay within that seven day frame <sighs> so yeah enough rambling let me go ahead and see what i need to edit because what is my mama doing do y'all hear that Guess who just finished editing? Moi. I did. I did all the hardcore editing. So by that, I mean I did my intro. Well, my intro is already pre-made. I inserted my intro and my outro. I cut and finalized all of the pieces that I want to be in my vlog. So basically front to end. So all I really have to do now is just add music, add titles, um, export, upload to YouTube, type up my title, in description make a thumbnail make sure i pass copyright but all of that tomorrow can be done pretty quick so i'm gonna just save that for tomorrow because time check it is 7 18 and i think we're gonna be leaving at nine and i'm not gonna lie i don't know what to wear like i just really don't know what to wear because like i said it's gonna be my first time like really like going out in charlotte um this isn't like a dinner it's like going out and it's labor day weekend so i'm expecting for it to be kind of packed i mean i wanted to be lit because who likes going out in a dead club like that's just whack you know so i really don't know what i'm gonna wear but right now i'm gonna hop in the shower and do a little scrub dub dub because yeah maybe i can mentally think of an outfit while i'm in the shower so i'm gonna think about it but i'm gonna keep y'all updated all right girlfriend so i know i look a little bright let me cut the light down i don't need it that bright right now i took my hair out of the bun the curls are a little distracted so i do want to wear it down because i feel like the club is a vibe when you get to when you get to you know you feel me so i feel like i could bring it back to life just by spritzing it a little bit because my curls like still very good this week like don't know what i did differently but they're they're holding up and today was the first day that i put it in a bun um so i guess i'll see if i can spritz them back to life and if i can't it's giving i'll probably do something like this which is also a vibe so i don't know i don't want to dampen it and spritz it too much because then i don't want to look like, like a wet puppy like i still want to keep the volume I still want to keep the body so let's see what we can make. Shape. I'm gonna just spray my edges. And some taught me how to put gel in my hair today, which I'm glad I didn't. Cause you never know. I never do a side part curly hair. Hold on, let's see. If I could tussle her to life. Okay, do I like this side? Do I, I usually go for this side. Hmm. I don't know. I'm going to have to play with her and see. Okay, I think, I, I think I'm rocking with the messy hair. This side just look a little flat. So I need her to 
flabbing up a little bit but i'm gonna go ahead and start my makeup y'all already know the process for my usual so i'm gonna go ahead and get through all of that and then i'm gonna come back and do the eyes because yeah let's just save some time you know I don't wanna be no ultimatum If you wanna come there If you wanna go stay If you wanna compare But you know you gotta work in the morning Then you wake up yawning Trying to keep up with a real one Don't got no obligations And at least for today And at least you can stay giving it's just really doing something to my spirit like that me uh it's just giving the big hair the side part the makeup like wow and it's just so funny to me because when i do my own makeup eyeshadow wise eyeshadow i feel like i really don't be knowing what i'm doing but on other people i just be like winging it like yeah girl we finna do this but the one thing about it it's gonna always come together don't really know what the inspiration or the vibe was but sometimes it's just better when you wing it so figure out what i'm about to wear i'm stuck between the two outfits and knowing me i'll probably not go with either one of them so regardless it's gonna be a good time and your girl's gonna look the fuck good okay so see you later after i figure everything out okay OOTD or OOTN. This top, I had it for years. I really don't know, but these pants are IMG. I gotta kind of move it down so y'all can really see. Then my boots are from Shein. These are thighs, but I'm rocking them like this. Because they're pointed toe. To the dance. Yeah. Now I hit that FBO with duffels in my hands. I did have a Zen, 13 hours till I land. Have me out like a light day, like a light day. smart for me to go out last night, you know, because I literally didn't get home until late. I need to brush my lashes. I didn't get home until late, and you know when 
you're kind of scared to oversleep so you get up extremely early that's me right now I have a client at 9 30 I have a client at 9 30 and it's like 8 30 right now and I'm already headed there so I guess I'm gonna go to Target because I need to get hair dye I'm getting my hair done tomorrow but don't mind me I'm super tired I think I'm gonna get two boxes of this. I don't know. I have a love-hate relationship with Target because it's so freaking quiet. Okay guys, that was such a quick in and out. But I just got two boxes of the Revlon color, so beautiful color in black. It was like seven dollars total. Fifty boxes, and yes, an unbox die isn't the healthiest, but who cares? I just need something that's gonna get the job done, and I don't know where Sally's is, so <clears throat> box die is just gonna have to cut it. <sighs> gonna be quite honest, I don't think I'm going to vlog me doing makeup because I just don't have the energy for that. It's what was that noise? It's too early, and I should have went that way, <sighs> but whatever. Good morning, guys. So, it is Monday. I feel like every time I come on here, I'm in my room. Oh, well, but um, I'm actually getting my hair done today. It's been a kind of busy morning. Like, I woke up early so I could touch up my black dye, so I did that. I had to finish below drying my bundles so yeah that's all I've really been doing and I had to like straighten up because I literally fell asleep last night we cooked out and I was on a girl child yes it would have been nice to record but baby we had a lot of food to cook and that heat one body thinking about getting no content like honestly but today's Labor Day so um I hope everyone's being safe Y'all eating some good food. It's a little gloomy here. It looks like it's going to rain. I think it's supposed to rain all week. So that sucks. But whatever. And of course, y'all already know Jana is going to be doing my hair. So she's a two and a half hour drive away. So I'm just about to finish getting ready. And find something to put on. And while I'm doing that, I'm going to insert some clips of us from last weekend it really wasn't enough to make up a vlog or to start vlogging so i just kept it and turns out it works out perfectly so um i'm gonna go ahead and play those clips and i'll see y'all when we get to the studio hey guys welcome to another vlog so i actually drove two and a half hours so i can hang out with janaya because that's really my girl and we haven't seen each other in a minute Whew, my legs are sore going up these steps because your girl been putting in work at the gym. Y'all yeah, already seen the outfit, but I never got pictures in it, so I wanted to wear it. Yes. Why are we starting? <laughs> we done took two shots. You said you feeling it? You finna feel this. <laughs> I don't wanna show your kitchen. We're in the middle of cleaning. Yeah. They making mac and cheese. For the cookout. Yeah, we're going to a cookout. Alexa. Play FNF by Glorilla. That's I couldn't find FNF. What? By Bora Bora, but here is other music by Bora Bora. No! No! No. Alexa. Hey Alexa. I don't know. Bitch. Alexa. Play FNF by Glorilla. Here's FNF. Let's go. My hit it and Let's go! go. <laughs> 
It's a quick weave. It's not a sew-in. And I officially think I'm a quick weave girl now. Because, one, it doesn't take as long as a sew-in. And two, I'm very tender-headed. So, the moment hairstylist starts sewing in tracks, it just is so uncomfortable to me. But this literally feels like nothing. Like, I went to sleep like an angel last night. And then, most girls, they usually keep their quick weaves in for like a week and a half, two weeks, maybe three. And that's like right up my alley. And I feel like the removal process would be much easier than trying to cut threads out yourself because I'm bound to cut out a braid bag. So, and I don't trust my mama because she don't know nothing about weave. So, I'm obsessed. She layered it this time um, just because I have layers in the front and it just gives it a more natural layered wispy vibe. I don't know if wispy was the right word, but you get what I'm saying. Like, you should be picking up what I'm putting down, okay? So yeah, I am obsessed. And if you're in the Raleigh area or if you want to go to Raleigh to go get your hair done, then please do. Janai specializes in silk presses, sewings, quick weaves, natural hair treatments, whatever, whatever the case may be. Just look with her. Because why else would I be driving two and a half hours to go get my hair done? Like, babe, I could easily go to someone in Charlotte, but I trust her and her work literally speaks for herself. So, um, I'm not sure what else... I'm not sure what I'm really doing today. I didn't take the time to plan my week out. And I'm okay with that. Because I'm actually in a very good mood. And like when you're in a good mood, it's just good to just run off vibes, you know. So that's what I'm doing. Um, I'll try to get her together next week. But for this week, we're just running off energy. We're just running off vibes. So 
but i do get my nails done tomorrow and these are three weeks old like look at it i know it look a little dingy because of course i colored my hair black so it made them look a little bit darker than what they are but three weeks babe not bad i'm telling you i'm plugging all of my girls this week like literally i got my hair done yesterday i get my nails done tomorrow i get my lashes done friday if i'm not mistaken yeah get into it okay so me and my boyfriend are supposed to be getting something to eat but of course you know men can never decide and i'm a libra so i'm naturally indecisive um so i don't know what we're gonna eat but right now i'm just putting on some clothes and i'm not gonna lie your girl has been very lazy when it comes to getting dressed like I'm really just about to throw on this little workout set and call it a day because it's just so freaking hot. And I feel like, and I feel like summer is cute for like a good two months. And after that, it's just like, why are you so hot? Like, come on, let's cool down. Like, let fall do its thing, you know? I don't want to wear a hoodie. I'm a fall girl. You know, I was born in the fall. Even though, like, around my birthday, it be kind of hot. Like, you just never know, like, around early October. Like, one year it could be 80 degrees. Next year it could be, like, 60. These days, I'm letting God handle all things above. Things I can't change it the reason you love me. Picky Eater didn't want stir for lunch. Tell him what. He wanted steak frites at stir. What the hell you just called me cookie eater? Picky. Oh. <laughs> she said cookie. Why would I call you cookie eater? <laughs> he wanted the steak frites. So you see that beer coming in now? Stop. And anyway. Shut up. He wanted steak frites from stir, but they only serve it during dinner time. And it's lunch time, so. We're about to go to the next place. Whatever he could come up with, because I ain't deciding. Your hat came up so again? Never Korean barbecue? I never had Korean barbecue. But I feel like we should do that for dinner. Though. Dinner <sighs> next option. girlfriend so it is the next day and i forgot to show you my nails but here they are <sighs> they're so freaking pretty i couldn't decide if i wanted black tips or chrome tips so my nail girl gave me both and that's just on period but they're literally so freaking perfect like i love them like i'm super obsessed I'm just obsessed with everything this week. But last night I did make my Amazon storefront and I'm so excited. I don't know why I procrastinated for so long like getting it together but I finally made it. So everything that I've ever mentioned on my page it is in my Amazon storefront. And I have so many different sections up there because I actually realized when I was going through my order history like girl you are an Amazon whore. 
like I just be buying any and everything and y'all better eat it up y'all better enjoy it speaking of Amazon my shades came today and they're so freaking cute like they just give a mood they give oh bitch we're about to go get some lunch and gossip it's giving I'm on vacation it's giving you hoes can't fuck with me that's what it's giving okay I'm doing a lot but no they're really cute I mean to my Amazon storefront <laughs> Ew. But no, um, I'm really in the mood to go get some food, but I'm going to wait till my mom gets home. I don't know if I want soul food or I don't know if I want Jamaican food. I really haven't had either of these since I've been here, but I know it's like two spots that I really want to try, either or. So I'm going to just wait until my mom gets home to see what she wants to eat. I hate her. She don't like my case. Yet. It's very nice. It's a camera case. Told them that we were deciding between Jamaican or soul food. Told who? Soul food. You told who? The vlog. <laughs> you told who? The vlog. <laughs> and what did the vlog say? I said I was waiting till you get home to make a decision. <laughs> but she never wants to make a decision. I said soul food. That's what I was No, you did not. No, you I did not. You said it doesn't matter. Then I said soul food because that's what I wanted last time. I night. just asked you. Turn that camera off. <laughs> she want to get busy. <laughs> Shake the shit out of you, girl. <laughs> So damn hard. You were the one who had to answer. Stop beating your head. Tough. You don't have these problems. You're right. You're not right. <laughs> well, you damn right. Cause she's whatever. <laughs> what the hell is that? <laughs> I'm <beat> you up. <laughs> Y'all should be so proud of me because my lash appointment is at 12 and I'm getting ready at 11. I just feel like I'm having such a good time right now because usually I will be doing my hair or getting dressed when it's time to be out the door. But I'm happy. Baby steps and I can never curl my hair the same way on the same side it's just so tricky oh my god like i did this side perfectly i don't know what's going on with this one but thank god it's friday even though like i usually work on the weekends i just be so happy to see the weekend i just feel like the vibe of the days are just completely different like no matter what 
is going on in my life Sundays are always kind of like not depressing but they just don't really give but a Friday a Friday is gonna give a Saturday is gonna give um I honestly feel like Wednesdays have a good vibe too because they're like their vibe is kind of like uh like we're halfway through girl like we could do it y'all yesterday the queen died and i'm not gonna say too much because i don't need nobody to cancel me but i feel like we all kind of have similar thoughts about the situation not to say it's a joking matter or anything but just got my lashes done they look so good and as much as I love them I kind of want to try other lash artists in Charlotte just because I feel like why not and my seatbelt is so freaking high <laughs> that looks more normal um I kind of want to try different lash artists in Charlotte just to see um if I like anyone else's work which I feel like I will because there's so many talented girls here who offer services um so yeah, I might keep up with her, um, the girl that I go to now, until after my birthday. Hey girlies, happy Saturday. Um, it's very gloomy today, very rainy, but I have two clients, so I'm just going to take you all through the rest of my Saturday, for the most part. Um, just to make up for me not vlogging much these past two days. But I just got an Amazon package and this is the Nunoa, Numoma, Numoa, don't know how to say it. But I got the viral camera light. I'm pretty sure you've all seen the Instagram and TikTok girlies talking about this. I just took it out the pack, but it's dead. But this has a clip. And I think I'm really going to enjoy this, not only for content creation, but also when I do my clients and taking photos. Um, sometimes I just need a light that's like right there on their face. So it really just gives what it needs to give. Um, so I'm actually charged this up before I start getting ready. But I feel very well rested today. Um... That's another reason why I haven't really vlogged much because your girl has just been so tired, so exhausted. But last night I got a good night's rest, so I am very pumped about that. I'm about to start getting ready just so I'm not rushing or anything because it's currently like 10 o'clock. Yeah, it's 9.56 and my first client is at 12, so I'm going to go ahead and start getting ready. Y'all, I completely forgot to show you all my horrendous disaster, but the other day I baked a cake and it turned out so freaking ugly. I don't think, um, I don't think I let the, the batter cool down enough when I went to take it out the pan. And then also I feel like that cake mix was old cause I had it back when I was at my apartment. So I just decided to use it, but she's ugly she is horrendous but she tastes delicious she's just not that cute <laughs> but before i left the kitchen i seen that i was like let me show them this cake i know y'all probably gonna fry me but i know how to bake a cake it might be boxed but i know how to bake a cake but lately i've been taking these chlorophyll pills by chlorofresh it is on amazon and i actually like it Sometimes the drops can be pretty messy, so I do like a pill form. I can't really tell the difference if it does anything or not. That was my other alarm. But I don't have any complaints about these. The only thing 
which I've seen it in the reviews, but I didn't think it would apply to me for some reason. But the difference with the chlorophyll pills and the drops, you know the drops, like, you just drink it like water. Cool. I like how these don't have a taste, but when you use the bathroom, it's going to look like chlorophyll. Just to let you know before you be like, what's wrong with me? It's going to look like chlorophyll. Just a little bit disclaimer. But enough yapping, let's get into the skincare. the street and get some chick-fil-a okay it hasn't stopped completely so let me hurry up and get in the car now that I think about it I completely forgot to tell you all that I got into a fender bender last week and I can explain the situation to you because I was at fault but here a bitch out I literally was on an exit that I was not familiar with trying to get some food, right? Because I was on the way home to go see my dad. So I didn't pack my vlogging camera because I just knew I wasn't going to film. And I was on this exit, exit 68 to be exact. Um, if you're on 85, don't take that exit because it's confusing as fuck. So it's a, the exit has three roundabouts but they're all like two or three lanes and all the lanes are like going like pointing and you see signs and I was just like e -e -e -e. like I don't know what's going on so I freaking get over check my blind spot I swear I did not see anybody then boom so I get out of the car I'm like what the fuck and it's a white guy he was clear and he does not say a word to me and I'm like hey I'm sorry like I honestly didn't see you he had literally a minor scratch on his car my car had more damage but I wasn't tripping about it because I was the one who was in the wrong but I just didn't want the cops to be involved because I had never been in an accident in the bender or whatever you want to call it so I just didn't want to deal with it and cops scare me also so he called the cops and he literally did not say two words to me 
and I'm just like, bro, like, he's dead ass ignoring me right now. Like, as soon as he got out the car, he was on the phone with the freaking 911. Like, babe, what? Like, are you kidding me right now? So, yeah, um, I have some damage done on my car. It's not... I'm not going to say it's not that big of a deal, because it is, because my car is white, so white and black cars, I feel like, just show every ding, mark, whatever, but that happened to me, and I was just so annoyed that I didn't want to do it myself, but it's okay. Insurance claim that it's not a big deal, but you know how they be, but I'm about to order my food, hold on. Not sure if y'all care, but I'm a Chick-fil-A Red member, and I have to have 10,000 points by the end of this year to remain a Red member. And basically with the different memberships, it's like, you get more perks, but I ain't really seen no perks. And apparently per dollar you spend, you get more points. But I'm only at 3,164, and it's already September. It's no way I'm going to continue being a red member or achieve signature status because who is spending that much money in chick-fil-a not me i love chick-fil-a but not that much but i just ordered a regular eight count nugget with fries and a water I'm trying to do better about my water intake but i'm gonna just head home and eat really quick i need to switch out my camera batteries because i thought this one would have lasted me all day like the light is literally popping up right now um, so I'm gonna just go home, eat, switch out my batteries, and then head back to the studio. So I'll see you all when it's time to do face numero dos. like the rain is on and off so i'll probably just be chilling in the house and i honestly need to go ahead and upload this video so i can have it posted by tomorrow so if you made it to the end of this video thank you so much for watching i really hope you guys enjoyed it don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you all next week bye